the ill patients in hospitals. Oxygen tanks are also in high demand, with about 14,000 cylinders consumed in the country every day. Kailin Bonkin looks into supply issues as people also start stocking up for personal use. These oxygen tanks were the lifeline of 70-year-old Perla Balanag at the height of infections in March. Coronavirus attacked her lungs. She needed a tank of oxygen every two hours. In another Quezon City hospital, Perla's older sister was also fighting the virus. Her nephew Eric says it was like a nightmare. There were a lot of patients in need of intensive care. Every second, they were scared oxygen supply could run out. Hindi po kami kasi mabigyan ng assurance na if may high flow siya, tapos mga kailangan kami ng tanke from the hospital directly, kakayanin po kaya. Kasi puno po yung ICU eh. Both of her aunts survived. Infectious diseases expert Dr. Ronjean Solante explains oxygen is crucial in treating severe COVID patients because the disease affects lung functions. Even those with moderate symptoms need this. Pag 100% naman ang kailangan mo ng oxygen, it will take like 7 to 10 tanks a day. So makikita mo yan, halimbawa, meron kang 10 pasyente dyan and then requires 10 tanks per patient. So that's already 100 tanks of oxygen. Health Department's data shows 63 of 1,200 hospitals in NCR Plus bubble are facing oxygen shortage once a month, while a few others are short of supply once in a week or in a day. Based from our data, ito pong ating current supplies, kung madodobli po per month no, ang ating mga kaso, ay sufficient pa ang ating mga needs for oxygen. But those looking for personal supplies for other illnesses might have a hard time buying oxygen tanks. On Thursday, several people looking for medical oxygen in Bambang, Manila left empty-handed. Sellers say they haven't had new supplies for almost a month. The Red Cross is looking at either putting up a plant or a mobile facility to produce oxygen. We're also looking at mobile uh, mobile generation plant uh, para kung magagamit doon sa mga lugar na kung saan ang pandemic na lumalakas, doon tayo maglalagay. The health department is also preparing for another possible surge. The task force is in talks with three major oxygen manufacturers in Cebu, Kalamba and Taguig City to increase their production. Caroline Bonk